Standing room only crowd expected tonight in Nanticoke at a public hearing regarding the planned closure of SCI retreat in Luzerne County. State officials announced it plans to close the prison in August. Public outcry has been loud and intense, and our lead IT reporter Andy Mahalshik is live in Nanticoke with the story. Andy? Well, good evening, Candace and Nick. That public hearing starts at 7 o'clock here at the Greater Nanticoke Area High School. And I can tell you, people in these parts are downright angry and outraged over plans to close SCI retreat. And those I spoke with today say they won't let it close without a fight. You know, we send billions. Many people in Luzerne County are saying, here we go again. Plans to close SCI retreat have them uneasy about what it could mean to the economy of the region. Jim Bach is the president of the Business Association of the Greater Shikshini Area. I think that they should look over the overall effect of this. I don't think that they all know exactly what the effect of. Officials from the Pennsylvania Department of Corrections say SCI retreat must be closed because it would take tens of millions of dollars to upgrade it. The 1,100 inmates or so would be sent to other state prisons. The 400 plus people who work here, including corrections officers, would be offered positions at other state prisons in the region. Now, SCI Retreat is located in Newport Township, which stands to lose hundreds of thousands of dollars in tax revenue. Nearby businesses would also feel the impact of the collateral financial damage. Any, obviously, the, the long term effects are, are an unknown right now, but uh, losing 400 jobs in a township the size of uh, Newport, it'd be devastating. State Senator Johnny Dechak is one of the lawmakers leading the charge to stop the closure. This hearing tonight, required by law, they're going to have to do a cost analysis. In addition to analyzing all of those factors, public safety, local economy, they're going to have to look, can this facility be repurposed, or will the taxpayers of Pennsylvania have to upkeep FCI retreat empty? For the rest of time. This is the second go around for retreat. It was targeted for closure two years ago, along with two other state prisons in our region. But public outcry convinced state officials to pull back from their decision. But this time around, SCI retreat is the only prison in the state's crosshairs. So this is a tougher fight. We understand that. The unions understand the families and the communities. But it's still the same fight, and the voices are loud and they're strong, and we're going to be very strong tonight when Northeastern Pennsylvania, when Luzerne County makes the case to save SCI retreat. And once again, that public hearing begins here at the high school at 7 o'clock. We'll also be streaming it live on PAHomepage.com, and tonight, live reports on Eyewitness News at 11. Reporting in Nanticoke, Andy Mahalshik, Eyewitness News. Andy, thank you. Tonight's testimony will be analyzed by state corrections officials as a factor in their ultimate decision whether to close SCI retreat. If the community effort to save SCI retreat fails, it could be shut down as early as March of next year.